Good morning, guys. It is 11 o'clock. I'm going to say 10. 11 o'clock. Um, Lydia's got something in a sandal. Just on his way to take Finn. Finn's booked in for archery. That's what he chose to do. And then later on, it's Chris Elliott and Lydia doing the high ropes, which you can see. I don't know if you can see. Just there. It's the high ropes. Um, so Finn's archery's at half 11. So we're just going to take him to go do that now. We've just walked in. There's amusement there. Amusement here. Looks like we're going this way. We need to find where it's at. Oh my god, it's May Avenue. We're just finding where to meet things actually. This is the food place. Oh god, I don't think we told you tail, tale, did we? About the food last night. Anyway, then when you come out of here. Oh, it's, it's so nice actually. It's just like I've been abroad, really. So you've got obviously a big lake there. There's an outdoor cinema, a little bar up there, beach. Um, well, fake little beach and a park here, a splash park. So we just, it is 20 past 11 and we're just waiting for Finn to start. It's half 11. But I'm just tired and. He seems to go to sleep in his chair, but when it's bumpy, it's <laughs> so having like a nice flat tarmac floor. I've had to come here and just go like on the bumpy grass. But it's working. I've done about 20 laps so far, but I've not known a baby to fight sleep as much as this one does. So hopefully I'll go to sleep soon and I can get a bit of footage of Finley doing archery. Also, where I'm walking him is where the high ropes is. Our caravan's like round back of there, but these are the high ropes I think that the that the kids are doing. But... Well done. Well done. Oh my God, so Finley's still doing his archery and me and these two have come for a walk. And we found this like, this football thing and I don't know if you can see it, like, like lights up there and it's talking to you and it's telling you where to Scott go or somewhere. I'm not sure, but it's good. I didn't know this little gem would here. Swimming pools there, high ropes are there. That's um, the, well, I don't know what it is. There's kids stuff that goes on there at night. So it's like an entertainment thing. This is right good, I might trust with this. Right guys, I've just been back to feed Arthur and I need to rush back because it's their turn on the high ropes. Obviously Chris is with me, which is fine, but um, up there. Lydia won't forgive me if I miss it so I'm trying to rush back now with Arthur don't worry I've not covered the side I've just pushed the chair up before anyone says they can't breathe or whatever um see so yeah, I'm trying to rush back now oh towels come off oh there look so I've just got here and Lydia is already up there oh, so no, do you have to climb my dad's already done it has oh, your dad already done it yeah. your dad's done it and then do you have to climb over there now? What, what happens when you get... Uh, when you get to the top, you just go down again. Right, and just take turns doing that. Go on, Lydia! Treasure. What Finn's just found? Found pieces to a necklace. Treasure. That's it! Well done! Oh, 
Elliot's next to her. I didn't even know it's Elliot. It's Ladue and Elliot. Well done, you two. Do you have to jump now? Oh no. Well done! Chris is going, he's volunteered to go first on this one. I'm not sure what they have to do, just climb up there or what. Meanwhile, me and Alf is chilling and he's not enjoying life right now. Than me. <laughs> Finn's filming this for you guys because I'm just yeah. bobbing Arthur. Yeah. And now it's Elliot and Lydia. Oh. Just Lydia, a minute. Yeah, just Lydia. Oh, person. <laughs> Hello. <laughs> if you can't tell, that's Lydia climbing up. Lydia! Right, It's wobbly. Oh my god, it's wobbling! screams at this part. <laughs> so, um, Alex climbing up now. It, he he had his jump out the furthest. So, yeah. You can choose where you have the, like, the rope to catch. He's just on this far Yeah, there. yeah. Come on, Elliot. <laughs> Everyone says, whoa, whoa. when you stand on that, don't they? Oh, you stand on it. Right, we're doing a little update. It is 10 to 5. I got it 10 to 5. Yeah. So it's 10 to 5. Um, we've all been in, had lunch. I just made hot dogs for everyone. Nice and easy lunch. Cheap, nice, easy lunch. And I just had salad. Um, what's happened since then? These three have been to amusements. We only, we only like spent five quid. We only spent five quid. 
Finland spent nine and lost a pound. Oh, he's lost a pound. Um, and then, so I think I mentioned before, the only bad thing really here is that you've got to book to do anything. Um, and, you, and people's booked up three weeks in advance, which means we didn't have a clue. So we, we wanted to go to Splash Park, um, but it's booked up. So we've just walked to try and queue. Then we wanted to go to the swimming pool there and that's all booked up. So Chris is queuing in there to try and get in. Cause I think it must, Chris must have been queuing an hour yesterday to get in. And then you do get in when you've been queuing an hour, but I mean, it's 27 degrees. So we're all sat in the shade. <laughs> um, well, Chris is queuing. In fact, he's only third away or something. That's what fast one. No, yeah, he's got some cream on. Um, so that's the only bad thing, really, that um, that you've got to book everywhere and everything's kind of booked up. Even oh, indoor splash it. park. Lydia wants to make sure you know that she's been on this. And then she climbed, she climbed up this thing and swung onto this. So we're just in the pool, um, well we're not in the pool, me and Arthur's just on the sunbed in the shade. For obvious reasons we're not allowed to film in the swimming pool area. Um, but I just thought I'd quickly update you. So it was only about 20-25 minutes Chris had to wait. Um, Chris and the older kids are in and me and Arthur's just chilling in the shade. Oh, what? Yeah, it does have a swim napper but... I've I don't know how I feel about him going in the pool just yet. Um, obviously he's got sun cream on and everything, but I don't know, I feel like it's way too hot, way too busy, and I just don't know how I feel yet, but we'll, we'll see. I still can't see him going in, but we'll see. But he's happy, are you, in the shade? He's happy in the shade, are you? What? Yeah? So I just started update yeah. Um our caravan is literally on that next like I say busy road, it's not a busy road, but like busy road within the camp, if that makes sense. And it's so pretty, but it's a busy road. Oh Chris has been there. Chris has been looking for for a bin for ages because um we emptied the kitchen bin and we just tied it up last night and we left it on the bottom step and then we're gonna look for bin today. We forgot, but it's um, still there, we need to put it in. But Foxes went in it last night, so it's all ripped open, so we've had to double bag it, and we just need to find a bin, but it's literally one there, I'll show you. There, <laughs> there's a bin thing there. This road, so it's not like a busy road, but it must be like one of the main roads, you know, in the caravan site. How cool is this place? Honestly, I just love it. Anyway, cars are always driving up and down here. But um, that's fine. I love it here. So yeah, I'm just gonna do a Mexican for tea. It's seven o'clock, Arthur's just having his feed, Chris is feeding him. I'm gonna do a Mexican fajitas for tea. Well, actually I'm gonna compromise doing fajitas because there's no frying pan. Um, it's just like a few normal pans. So I'm gonna have to try and fry the chicken in that. There's no cooking oil, so I'm gonna have to use butter. Um, I don't know what else we're stuck on, but it's all about compromise. Compromisation, I nearly said. I don't know if that's a word. There's a car. Um, it's all about compromising, you know. We, we're on holiday, we're camping ish. Um, so I'll see what there is. So, this is what I've got to work with. I'm going to do the nachos in this, fry the chicken, <laughs> fry the chicken in there with the butter as the oil. The fajita kit, I've got um, more wraps there, and then salad and guacamole and sour cream for nachos. But this is the, how big the kitchen is, and when you've got the sterilizer, it takes up all that. Then you've got no space really, so it's will be interesting. So, this is me frying the chicken off. <laughs> Two pans because one's not enough. So I'm just currently doing that. And then in the oven, we've got 
Nachos. Oh, they're looking all right, actually. <coughs> and then we've got salads out, <coughs> cheese and sauce. So this is the finished product. The chicken I've had to cook in um, butter, which didn't look oh, bad. Mexican nice. rice. Mum, you have to get in. Cheese. Tomorrow. Hi guys, so, oh, is that the sun? Wow, that's bright. It is the next day, so it's Thursday, we go home tomorrow. Um, I've not actually done a daily vlog today, and I've also realised I didn't end last night's vlog. Um, today we didn't do, or we've not done anything exciting, it's four o'clock. However, Chris has taken the kids on the water obstacle course, so I'm going to try and film, since Chris wasn't able to do that on his go. So I'm going to try and do it for you guys. Um, so they're actually on it now, I'm about five minutes late. So hopefully I'll be able to film a bit of that and then I can end the vlog. I found them. Um, I think Elliot's there, Lydia's there, that might be Chris. Finley's got bright yellow shorts on, he's there. Oh look, there. Oh, the stuff. Oh, what's Elliot doing? Oh. Trying to slide, but it's not come out. There he is. There's Lydia going down the slide. Oh, Elliot's going on that. Is he gonna do it? Oh, oh. <laughs> Finley. Finley going. Oh, he's done it. He's done it. Right, Lydia. What are you gonna do it? Is she gonna do it? Oh my god. <gasps> Woo! Uh, sorry if I'm rocking, I'm trying to rock half of it and push there as well. This is so good guys, we literally love it on this. Elliot and Chris, well I was gonna say Elliot and Chris are like big kids, but Elliot's 16 so I suppose he is. <laughs> There's the big pigs rolling each other down. Oh! <laughs> oh! <laughs> oh. <laughs> oh, that's been there. Uh, oh, <laughs> I don't know how Lydia's gone. What? Hi, darling. Hello, sweetheart. Hello, sweetheart. My little darling. Are we watching these on there? Are we watching them? Are we? Yeah, we are. <laughs> I think Lydia's about to go in that swing, so I'll try and catch her doing the swing. She loves that slide as well. Oh, that castle's beautiful, isn't it? Right, I'll see if I can catch her on the swing. Right, it's Elliot. Oh, well, it's Lydia's turn. I think Elliot's helping her on the swing. It's quite hard to get on, actually. Stay on. There she goes. Thing is, when I, when I went on this, you belly flop all the time. Oh, oh, that was a good one, actually. That was a good one. Right, watch Elliot's craziness on it. Pushes off on one side and goes for it. Oh. <laughs> Hi guys, this is the future me. I'm just editing the video and I've realised I've not even done an ending to it. So this is the ending. Thank you so much um, for watching. If you did like it, please do like and subscribe and we will see you in our next video. Bye.